yeah, I'll hop off. But yeah, I've been, I've been having a lot of fun doing everything and uh, yeah, yeah. all that stuff. No, um, yeah. Good, yeah, good calm down with you. Yeah, good to come see you too. Cat's getting good. Yeah, she's improving. Cat's getting good. She's getting quite um, competent. Uh, yeah. um, can you put the water bottle somewhere else? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, shit. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. no worries. Oh, good. Oh, well, that's, I have no idea who's bottle. Yes, Please. no biggie. Um, so, yeah, up next is Catherine and Scraddle. So, this is Liz's quarters. Damn, this is another best of five. Good to see the um, the brackets up to that point. Um, yeah, uh, I think the other Lisa's quarters is yet to be decided, and then yeah, these ones are already decided. Also, sure. Shout outs to Brad for putting a bottle right in front of the camera. The I big know. scrad daddy himself. Oh. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna rectify that very very quickly. Yep, yep, yep. So I believe last time these two played, um, Catherine won. It was. 2-0, they were both quite close games, but, um, you know, a lot's changed. We'll see how they go. It's, it's a new day, um, and they'll probably strike the battlefield. I feel like, as the Fox, you probably ban... Okay, yeah, it's okay. So, Catherine banned Dreamland, um, and, yeah, the Fox. So, battle, battlefield starting. That's, yeah, your that's average, that's your average one. What's well, thing? It's only average if the Peach doesn't like Dreamland, right? Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Because like, as the, it's like it depends on the Fox. If you think you're, if you think like, um, it's like even Battlefield or Dreamland, right? Because if you don't think you can utilize the space as well as the Fox, well, like the Fox can generally utilize the space against Peach better, but you have more survivability, which is crucial. If you don't think that like is enough, then you go Battlefield, but. Also, like, the Battlefield ledges are pretty bad for Fox. Like, not being able to ride that wall is actually pretty big. Because, as Peach, you just, like... You can kind of just put out a bear right next to the ledge. Like, just space enough and you'll beat every upbeat angle from below. Not from above, but... Um, uh, same height, unfortunately. But, you know, still closes it out. Um, yeah... Scary spot for the pitch, but manages to make, sort of make it back. Yeah, you can't. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. That like the up throw down smash. Um, you just can't do it above like zero to five. I think I'm pretty sure it's like it stops working. Maybe about ten percent stops working. Right, right. It definitely is like port dependent. I think it's actually more likely to work if you're um port. If you're like close to port to port one. Which is pretty much the opposite of like everything else related to um pros. But yeah, really good there to get out of the jab. Um, really okay, well, they kinda of just traded center, but we'll see what Captain gets off this. Yeah. It's like that's a pretty classic. If you think like, I like lower percents if you think up air is going to convert to something, you go for up air on like tech and place. If you think they're going to tech roll left or right at like mid percents onwards, you can go for um, double jump land and then tech chase into like a re grab. Otherwise, at like high percents, if you think they're going to um, uh, tech and place, then you just nail. So this is such a. Oh, that's. I mean, every fox has done that up smash, but it's just such a. Bad up smash. Like Peach is in the corner holding shield, and you're like, you know what? You're gonna jump now. It just it costs you so much. Like we've all been there, but oh, the strong hit! How did that get the strong hit? That was so good, actually. That <laughs> was really clutch, real clutch. It makes such a great sound as well. That like, but yeah, I actually don't think that that was true. Though I think um, Brad could have jumped out or shined out, but sometimes you're slipping. I know myself, so when I'm getting grabbed by Moth, there's definitely percents where I can jump out, but I just don't. Just don't hit in time. Oh, bad side B. Like, obviously a flop. Um, but he has, like, this. Like, Brad's just running it. Brad's kind of just running at Kath and, like, overwhelming with good hitboxes. Yeah, These uh, and I think Kath is one to wave dash back out of shield. Oh, that's Ooh, it. Yeah. The little charge too. Little charge. 
Love pretty, that. pretty yeah, you do the spells, I'll do the. Uh, yeah. Uh, where is oh, there we go. Oh, well, oh my god. Yeah, we can. Nice. Oh, yeah, yep, yep. Ready? Go! I'm going straight back into it, into game two. And FUD always probably the pick for. For uh, Peach going into game two, I feel. It's like. Yeah. You can really start. Setting up the you know the narrative of the set on this stage if you're Peach. Pretty right. much. I mean, like it's, the platforms are really useful, and not just for whole, like oh down smash, but like lower platforms are just really good for Peach's combo extensions. Yeah. Being up, like, agreed, up there. Agreed. Yeah. Ooh, that's gonna do it. Pretty not too bad of a first stock for Kath, but um, no. still got a bit to work on. Uh, is that uh, just doesn't that probably kills on battlefield? Maybe. Um, <laughs> like slight yeah. extra height. Uh, classic. Yeah, Brad. Brad loves the boot. He, <clears throat> who, what Fox does in NTSC? They buffed it. God bless. Buff is an understatement. Buff. Um, <laughs> oh yeah, that's another classicer. Just rise from the ledge with a down air, and then you get you free up smash. Mm. It's a good but time for you if you're a fox man. <laughs> but the thing is, it's like, oh yeah, the down smash yeah. is starting to get uh, sussed out. Yeah, that I think they've, they've been sussed out for a while. It's yeah. like, I feel like that's been a big um, detriment to Catherine. Like, yeah, you noticed it in the set previous to this as well. Yeah, yeah. It's just. And the thing is, if they're waiting like that, you can just do something like a shield drop down. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Oh, good time. Is that gonna... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always so weird with, like, COD, just because you zoom out, like, you get magnified so early on that it's hard to tell whether to actually that far away or whether just, you know, close enough to the stage to make it back. Um, but... Okay, good, really, really good patience by Brad, uh, just to, like... Wait out a bit of the float and then time the bear. Um, weird F2 play cap, but. These side B's are. These like side B flops. I just. Yeah, I definitely caught my fair share of those. I want to say both sets. <laughs> Good tech chasing. Right. Side fight and just put out a bear when Peach does pretty much any sort of um, is in any sort of like okay good roll oh good yeah Sorry. Right. yeah you got there we go all right so Catherine probably banned yeah so Catherine banned um, oh wait no oh this is best of I'm um, not so dumb this is best of five yeah. Yep. We're talking about bands, but we'll think of bands. We're talking about bands, we got none. Mm. What are you doing? I guess it makes sense because Brad is definitely a Yoshi's style fox, so I can't say my band Yoshi's. He's not really one to like willingly run and gun. Though more so than some other foxes in the NSA. Well, in the past. So Brad in that, like, on knockdown, Brad has been teching um, to center a lot, and Catherine's just been catching on these past, like, these past two games or so. Um, okay, barely does it. Um, yeah, not, not the greatest down smash there. Like, sometimes you just have to play the, like, a slow um, space game against Fox at low percent. You just can't. Sometimes you have to like accept that you know 
I'm just going to put out a space nail bear and get that 11% and get him slowly out of CC range. I can't just put out a down smash at zero. Hope that it does 40%. Spacing that eventually lines that uh, bear. Oh. All right, here we go. So honestly, neither of them are that great at dealing with jab. Sure. Oh my god! It's just <laughs> it. It's every day. It's it's. <laughs> There's not a tournament that goes by when I where I'm just like, god damn. <laughs> But yeah, neither of them are that great at dealing with uh, jab on shield. Seems yeah. like it. Yeah. Oh, there you go. There's a CC. He's hold down. But still, he caps like maybe maybe five percent away from dying. Oh, oh, God, oh. God, never mind. <laughs> Fifty-six. Never mind. That was a fifty-six percent stock on the platform. Right? Holy man! Oh, I don't mean oh, yeah. it. Should have. Yeah. Cool. Alright, yeah, so even Dream on FD. Honestly, Calf Chain Grab isn't that great. Nah, it's okay, no, it's like. Definitely not. It's, um. Oh, it's yeah. not one that I rate. Let's yeah, but the gun, you know. It has improved a bit, but. Tournament pressure. It's. The thing is, it's. The Chain Grab's actually decently high from like 0 to 30. It's just. Ooh, is that a stitch? Damn, Wait. they're already at Winner's Semis at Smash Bros. Damn, what's it, what's it look? Is our boy? SA Nick and Dombey in the winning semis. Ooh, that should be a really good set. It's happening right as we speak. That's where all of our viewers went. Oh, yeah, yeah. They all went to yeah. twitch.tv slash ggeasybar. You know, honestly, fair. That's fair. I mean, like... I, I SA like, Local just doesn't have SA, that SA local. Dom Hines production value. That's that's just totally the reason. It's, it's you know, <laughs> we're lacking the star power, it's especially like... Without Nick. Without Nick. Yeah. Without Nick, people well, I think I saw her as well. Nick saw her. Nick saw her would be the one like, to watch tonight. Yeah. That's okay, we, you know, we can watch our VODs later and get those view numbers up then. Red's Brush is coming along pretty alright at the moment. His offense has actually got a little, little less holes in it, playing a bit more safe with it instead of just uh, rushing in with an air. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, he's actually using down air now. It's, Ooh. it's a pretty good move, especially Hell in this yeah. matchup. It, um, yeah, just play this neutral. All you need is a wave shine, up smash, or a drill, grab up, up there. Yes, thing, and like Catherine's SDR. Ooh. Oh, back in. Oh, I, I don't know. Terrible recovery. Terrible recovery. Yeah. There. I'll, I'll, I'll be the first to say that. Uh, up being high when you're that close to the ledge is kind of a bit of a misplay when you're up against Peach, who needs to be exploited. Yeah, like her speed yeah. needs to be exploited in order to get back there. Oh, uh, another stock Ooh. is could yeah. be gone. Oh, no. thing. In that spot, when you do that first down air, you have to pull a turn. Yeah. Because, oh, well, actually, no, it's hard. It's hard against down air because if they up you immediately after the down air, you may not have time to pull a turn. And, but that's why, honestly, in that spot, you kind of want to put out a bear. Mm. I mean, Scrat Daddy's even the stocks, but... Okay. Oh, oh he, okay, yeah. That's, that's a, a really good take stock. the double jump. That's... Really good stock for Brad. Looking probably pretty happy with himself. After oh, yeah, that. you just, just basically just. You know, he boxed. Sometimes he you just boxed. get a shine spike. And you just get a shine spike at like 20 and they die. It's known to happen. Mm. Oh, good, good tomahawk. Oh. Catherine starting to. Yeah, hurt. definitely. Yeah. Uh, oh, I thought that was it. <laughs> the tournament life is flashing before my very eyes. Oh, and that's going to yeah. do it. 3-1. Yeah. And that's one of the losers' quarters yes. done. All right, we should have... Uh, we should yeah, don't bother yeah, putting yeah, in the yeah, last yeah, game. Right, just, uh, we should have... Just um, do that. And then yeah.